for joining us for Monday's Living Word. This week we're going to look at areas that we and what causes us to limit God. So we're going to start with Psalm 78 and verse 40. How often did they provoke him in the wilderness and grieve him in the desert? So they provoked God and they grieved him. How? What happened for God to be grieved with them? And I know in the New Testament, we're not grieving God, but it does say we can grieve Holy Spirit. And verse 41, yea, they turned back and tempted God and limited the Holy One of Israel. God can be limited in our life by you. He doesn't limit himself. It's not according to your good works. But how do you limit God? And here it says they also tempted him. Well, we're their t the temptation there Jesus bore. But how do we limit God in our life? We can look at what the word has promised us, but what limits him? And in verse 42, it says they remembered not his hand, nor the day when he delivered them from the enemy. They did not remember the day that God delivered them out of Egypt. This week, remember, concentrate on, think about the fact that Jesus delivered you from the hand of the enemy, that Jesus delivered you from Satan. And don't stop and think it can't come to pass because Jesus got the victory for you. So this week, we're going to also look at ways to prevent limiting God in our lives. Thank you for joining us today.